How do you make some part you don't want into an STL file? Today on Hobbies and Hot Rods. So I've been putting this video off for a while now. And I know I said quite a while ago that I would do a video on how to convert SolidWorks files uh, or step files to SDL files so you can print them. And that's what we're going to do today. Let's say you have uh, an RC car you want to copy. So we'll just search for instance Lucy Micro T. Lucy Micro T model. Okay, so here we have all the search results for our Lucy Micro T model. And I did model like 3D model, but I didn't want to specify a 3D model. And right here, grabcad.com. You'll find that grabcad has a lot of 3D models that engineers did and things like that where people use SolidWorks a lot more often instead of Tinkercad. And, and uh, you'll find STL files are not the common use uh, and being I've worked with SolidWorks and, and quality control and things like that most of the time it is a step file or a SolidWorks file so we'll go to GrabCAD and this is just you can go to GrabCAD searching for any kind of model and in my experience most of the stuff you really want to print when you get into the nitty-gritty of printing the the stuff that's really going to be exciting to print it's the wrong file type so here I've got the this guy even has a uh, complete assembly um, and then every individual piece on here so we'll just take the shock tower here load in 3d viewer and this is all online I don't have any of this downloaded this is on streaming on the web I guess you could say so here's our model and it's just like SolidWorks file you can see all the little areas specifically you could also load this into FreeCAD on Linux, uh, which is similar to SolidWorks or Fusion 360. So here's our file here, and this is just you can you can get these files on here and just go up and download file, and then you can download it. And you can see right here it says Front Tower .sldprt for solid part, and uh, we'll go ahead and save that it's downloaded so next how do you get that SolidWorks file or solid part to an STL uh, you can go to GrabCAD now here's my profile I suggest you go to GrabCAD and uh, you can see the full address up here this is GrabCAD workbench there's several different ones you can shop GrabCAD you can also print uh, you find some model you want who wants to do that that's lame right have somebody oh no wait a second that's a desktop app I thought it was to have somebody I've seen on Thingiverse you can have somebody print your files you just send them the dough and they mail it to you and you want that person to be you, not the man. You want to be the man who's selling it. All right, so here's my workbench. And you can see I already have some files on here. But just for uh, learning purposes, we'll go ahead and download the file that we just downloaded. I mean, upload the file we just downloaded. So once you make a profile on here, you can go to your page here and start a project and uh, download files. And uh, but I want to show you every every detail. That way, there's no questions like, "What are you doing between this and that?" So we'll go to create new project. Oops. Downloads. And you can either download the app, which I have also, we'll go over that in a second, or you can just drag and drop files here. So we'll pull back up our folder. There's our front tower. 
drag and drop and you can describe your upload if you want to I don't want to so it is uploaded done and now you have one file in your project which we named downloads so and you can see here file type SLD PRT and that will not work in Kira so we'll just open this and it opens it just like it did when you looked at it as a, a non profile haver before when we were just browsing on the web so it'll bring up the file and you can just like before but this is the one we uploaded so it's uploaded on there and now all you gotta do is go to file options download as and see it, the first option is step and you have all these other kinds of files right here you can download it as so all we had to do is upload it open it go to file options STL and we went high download and then it will prepare the files for download and now it says it's ready for download and we will go ahead and save it and just to test this we'll get out of this open up Kira here here's our downloads folder again and you can see there's two different ones here front tower STL and front tower solid part so we'll take our STL here and there you go see what it does the other one it says cannot open files you don't do solid parts here this is Kira well I hope this is helpful Please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Hobbies and Hot Rods.